All right, so like I said, um, don't miss, don't miss the next lesson that we're going to have. It's uh, going to be purely sketching and uh, graphing, rather it's going to be purely sketching graphs of logs and exponential functions. So don't miss, because those things are a bit confusing. I'm not saying they are difficult, they're a bit confusing. Don't miss, I emphasize, don't miss the next lesson that we're going to have. Yeah, so if you have any friend that would also like to join our lessons, you can also inform them, you can give them my line, let them contact me, and then we'll see how we're going to help each other. So my lines are, my lines are here. Let me just display my lines. So these are my lines here. So you can give them any of these lines here. They contact me, then we'll see how we're going to help each other. Yeah, so I'll be with you until you write your exams, unless otherwise. If you have any questions anytime, feel free to ask. I'll be trying my best to help anytime, anyone. Yeah, so let's quickly uh, begin to solve this one. This is, a, this is a very simple question. So how do we rewrite uh, these um, uh, logarithmic functions into exponential functions? So it's simple. Like I said, if you have log A base B is equal to X, what you have here, I'm calling it a base, and it will also remain a base even in exponential. So this B, let me even use a capital letter B. It will also remain a base even in exponential. So it will still be a base. And then this one is going to be our power. And then we have this being equal to what we have there. So this is the format we're going to follow to convert this. So we have uh, the log of 36, being equal to negative two. And the best that we have here is one over six. Remember, the best will still remain the best. And the power is going to be uh, taken as that. And then this will be equal to what? 36, we have converted to exponential. We quickly move on to the next one. So the next one, converting it to exponential is also simple. We have, um, log of 2073, six being equal to four. And then the best is 12. Remember the best will still remain the best. And the power is going to be taken as whatever you have, um, whatever you have on the right, you take it as the power there. So best 12 to the power four, this is equal to, 27.36, this is what we have. So this is how you convert, it's very simple. We quickly move on to the next one. So the next one is the log of 243 being equal to five over two and the base is nine. So converting this to exponential is simple. The base is nine, so the base will still be the base even in exponential. And then the power is simply what you have on the right there. So the power is five over two, and this is going to be equal to 243. So we have 243. We move on to the second last one, which is that one. So it's also very simple and straightforward. So we have the log of, one over 128 base four being equal to negative seven over two. Converting this to exponential is simple. How do we do it? The base which we have there will still remain the base. The power is negative seven over two. So we put negative seven over two there and this should be equal to one over 128. This is what we have. Same applies to the last part there. It's still also going to be the same. So we follow the same procedure. We have the log of 3,000, I mean 32,768 32, 
and then the base is eight, this being equal to five. So converting this is also simple. What you just do is you take the base as the base there, even an exponential. And then what you have on the right there is the power. And then this is equal to anything that you have there, which is three, two, seven, six, eight. Do we have any questions on these uh, questions that we have covered? All right, so we don't have any questions. Okay, so um, uh, let's move on to the next question. So like I said, if you have any uh, friends that would like to join the lessons, feel free to tell them about these classes. Yeah, so, so that we can be learning together. All right, so we move on to the next question. So the next question is this one. The next question says, we, we write uh, the following expressions to logarithmic uh, form. So these are already in exponential form. So now we have to rewrite them into logarithmic form. So the first one is 11. Okay, let me stop recording. Okay, I think this one is simple. We can just combine the two videos in one video. So we have 11 negative three is equal to one over one, three, three, one. So it's also very simple. Uh, how do you convert this to log? So it's simple. The base is the base. The power, so you can even start by writing the power. So the power is negative three. We say this is equal to what? Log, whatever you have here, which is one over one, three, three, one. And then the base is what? The base is 11. So we put our 11 there. Move on to the next one. The next one is four to the power seven is equal to 1,000, uh, means 16,384. So how do we write this into uh, the log form? So the base will still remain the base. So the power is seven. So I can start by writing the power there. And then I'll write log, what I have there, which is 16384. Then the base is what? Is four. So I'll still write my base there. We proceed to the next one, which is C. So C is two over seven uh, raised to the power negative three. This is equal to three, four, three over eight. Converting this to exponential, I mean to log is simple. So we write negative three, which is our power is equal to, um, we say log, three, four, three over eight. And then the best that we have is, sim is simply two over seven. So it's simple to convert these things. So we move on to the next one. So the next one is uh, 25, three over two being equal to 125. Convert this to log. So converting this to log is simple. The base is still the base. So we say log 125, the base is what? 25. Then we say this is equal to the power, which is three over two. So it's as simple as this. It's very simple. Yeah, so this is a very simple question. Okay, so we move on to the next one, which is this one. So we have 27, the power negative five over three being equal to one over uh, 243. So we can write this to logarithm as the base will still be the same, the base will still be 27. So the base we have there is 27. And then we're saying the log of one over 243. And we say it's equal to what? The power which is negative five over three. But I'm trying to look at this one. Can it surely give us three over two as the answer? Let's try. So 25 can also be written as, uh, I mean, 125 can also be written as what? Well. Oh, I see, can give us, right? Okay, so this is how you convert. Do you have any questions about converting, about writing the, uh, 
expressions in the logarithmic form. Okay, so if you don't have questions, I think this is the end of our tonight's lesson. Make sure next time when we meet, you don't uh, miss the lesson because we're going to be looking at how we sketch the logs and exponential functions. It's a bit tricky. You need to attend this lesson. If you also have a friend who is struggling in logarithms, they are not understanding, tell them to say there's someone who is able to uh, explain these things clearly. And if you have questions, he always attends to our questions whenever we ask him. So tell them and let them contact me. Let's see how we can, how best we can help each other. More especially the next lesson. I want everyone to attend. All right, so thank you very much. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me on any of these lines on the screen or email on Facebook, uh, YouTube, Instagram, or Twitter. You can simply just use these same lines. On Telegram, you can use the second line, which is my MTN line. All right, so thank you very much for attending tonight's lesson. See you in the next lesson that we're going to have. My name is Hamtet. Shalom, shalom.